need a little practice reading, or just love dogs? We'd like to introduce you to a very special program available in many of your Fairfax County Public Library's branches. Our Read to the Dog programs help young readers gain confidence and maybe even a new furry friend. Read to the Dogs um, is a kind of a practice session where kids can come in yes. and read to a trained yes. therapy dog. It gives the children a, a place to practice their reading skills um, because the, way, the best way to learn a new skill is to practice, practice, practice. Um, Abby and I started this program here at, at Patrick Henry Library nine years ago and uh, she was certified as a read dog and the READ spells for Reading Education Assistance Dogs. Many children come in here with learning disabilities and reading is very difficult for them and they become nervous while they're reading out loud so the dog calms them down. They usually pet her while she's listening to their story and it helps them um, with their vocabulary, it helps them with their enunciation and just everything across the board for better reading. The children come um, for 15 minutes each and it's one child per dog and I'm here to facilitate that, but I don't say anything unless the child needs help with a word. This is Truman. We've been volunteering here at the Herndon Fort Nye Library for uh, over two years. And some of the kids uh, who come more often, every time they come we see an improvement in how well they read, uh, in uh, how well they pronounce, how well they recognize words. It's just uh, really rewarding. We have a lot of fun doing it. We have it from ages 6 to 12, but I've had younger and I've had older. And I've had very proficient readers and I've had readers with uh, a great deal of difficulty. But we get through it and I do see improvement in every week. What time is it? It feels too early to be awake. I'm reading The Never Girls from The Mist. It's it's about the Tinkerbell movie, and, but with four girls going into the, the fairy world. It was fun, and usually when I read at home, I, I don't really enjoy the book, but today when I read to Truman, I enjoyed the book. The books that we offer at the program, again, they can be, kids can read whatever, but we like to try to tie in whatever holiday is coming up or, you know, if it's been really rainy for the last few days, we'll find some rainy day books. And of course, books about dogs. Um, I, I like to never put out any cat books, so the dogs can always know that they're in a safe place without any cats. <laughs> well, she seems to like all the Clifford dog books and the kids seem to like to read those to her, so she, uh, she'll listen to anything but she just she really just loves the kids it's just a great program uh, it works i've seen it work and uh, i love being a part of it and so does abby good boy interested in signing your child up to read to a dog visit your local branch and pick up our print calendar of events or search events online at fairfaxcounty.gov library now let's check out some fun books that celebrate our favorite four-legged friends. Beginning readers will fall in love with Henry and Mudge, a ready-to-read series featuring a boy and his lovable 180-pound dog, Mudge. Chester and Gus is a story of the remarkable bond between an aspiring service dog and a young boy in need of a friend. For service dogs with a slightly larger task at hand, check out Secret Service Dogs, the heroes who protect the President of the United States. Take a leap into the canine world in Inside of a Dog, What Dogs See, Smell, and Know. And last but not least, end your story time with a little bit of puppy love. True stories of doggy devotion.